Callie Halverson, her star astrology, Callie died some years ago, one of a few uh, lovers in my life who have um, left the physical plane. But one day I was hanging out with Callie in her house in Berkeley or uh, San Francisco or somewhere, and um, she said, oh, 12th house. She studies with the Brahas. She used to study with the Brahas who were, who were into Vedic. She said, Vedic astrology says 12th house is the house of the pleasures of the bed. So I thought about that for a long time and, of course, had my share of experiences that uh, I could test out. And, and the thing that makes the 12th into a... Uh, the thing that defines or describes the pleasures of the bed as a 12th house experience is that the best sex has a dreamlike quality, no matter how physical it may be, and the best sex has a sense of being in a parallel reality... For example, when you wake up the next morning and you have that sensation of wondering whether that thing actually happened. Did, all, did I do all those things? What I, I, I like to kid to my lovers when I wake up in the morning and say, Wow, I had this really amazing erotic dream and you were in it. Meaning... We had a lot of fun just three or four hours ago and fell asleep and woke up. And usually they get the joke. So with Pluto moving through the 12th, this is passion. Uh, it is... Um, it, it, it is a very driven form of passion, P Pluto's uh, urgent need to transcend the death and resurrection quality of Pluto, the transformational quality of Pluto, uh, such that you're unlikely to be seeking garden variety, peanut butter and jelly type sexual experiences. You, you, want, the, you want the sexual experiences, as far as I can imagine, that, that challenge you to immediately in that scene become... A, a different person to stretch into a new aspect of your incarnation right then like being born only you're doing it as a conscious thing you're in this co-creative experience where you're sort of moving with a person and you get to guide and then they guide you and that's the the 12th house and the experience must change you in some way or it's not real sex. With masturbation, that's, that, that can be tricky, but you can do that. You can seduce yourself into deeply self-transformational experiences of, uh, of, of solo sex. Okay. Okay.